What is up fam, my name is Shap, and welcome back to another episode of Scrap Mechanic. Scrap Mechanic. Yeah, so I mean, as you can see by the title, we're gonna look over at this uh, bright yellow bumblebee type vehicle over here. I just realized what we're missing. You know, why are we going to have a construction vehicle if people don't know that they're in a construction zone? Oops, upside down. Beautiful. I love it. I love it. So this is, uh, this is my go at a bulldozer. I'm actually really happy with the way it came out. Um, yeah. It's kind of funky when it gets on the grass and I have the blade down. Um, because it is legit touching the ground. Like, there is no clearance there. So it gets a little funky. And it does have a little trouble getting down off of this thing. But I will, um, so what we did, I'll show you, it's not, the spread webbing's not too, too bad. Um, I didn't put doors on it, and I tried fiddling with the windows, whoops, um, and I just, I could not get it a way I was happy with. Um, so there's no windows and the glass, just, I'm not, not a fan. Um, so there's two on each side, this middle piece is all, kind of alternating between sides. I mean, it's just hooked up to controller, so four and f or three and four always stay at the same angle one and two will go up and down and then five and six will also rotate to bring the blade up um and then this one operates some doors we put back here so we can so we can access the engines so i'll show you how it works real quick and obviously you know hydraulics and you know, air quotes, hydraulics. Um, so we do one, we'll bring the blade up. Yeah, I kind of like that. Should we? Hmm, I wonder, should we, uh, should we lower that a little bit by changing uh, three and four? Maybe we should, I don't know. It doesn't go super fast, but this thing is super heavy, and it just has a desire to not go perfectly straight, but that's okay. Um, all of a sudden, I'm not really, I don't like that that's parallel. Um, and we do have to crouch to get out. Uh, so let's let's fix this real quick. Cause this is gonna bug me. What was that? Uh, where are you? Right there. Oh jeez. Aha! There you are. All right. So we want this to go. We'll say that. And then we want this to go down another 15, I think. I think. Yeah, I like that. I think that looks a lot better. Um, hang on. I might be wrong. I might be wrong, fam. It does happen on occasion. Um. Okay, I think. I think we want this to be a little closer. So let's try 30 on that side. And I know we can do one degree increments. I just don't want to. 
And then I think, should we have that tilt a little more? A little more? <laughs> um, let's see how that looks at 30. Oh, that is, that is perfect. Much better. Much better. All right, let's get back up here. Seal this off. Um, let's see if we can do this with only triangle box. Ah, uh, beautiful. Nope. Why are you doing that? Yeah, anyway. And then, um, obviously, as previously stated, whoops. Come on. Up, up, up. Up, up, up. Up, up. And I realized after I was already pretty much done with this vehicle, because one of the last things I actually placed, um, I made this thing backwards, um, back to front. Um, so I didn't need... Because this is whatever it is wide, like four blocks wide, um, it's, as you can see, not quite even. Um, so we didn't, this is the first time we didn't actually need this because it's only one seat. Um, so we're going at one, two, three, four, five. Five and five. And, I mean, it moves. I mean, 10 is just crazy. Like, it, it, it'll, like, flip over. Alright, let's see. I kind of want to get, like, a running start here, fam. Let's see if we can, uh... Charge! Oh, this thing likes to... Much better. Much better. When I did this uh, yesterday, <laughs> this thing did not want to go down. Like it took like a good extra two, three minutes just to finagle itself. Um, I don't. I still don't think we're going to be able to get back up. I think the blade will hit. But let's give it a little bit of a running start here and see what we can do. Three, two, one. Stop it. This. No. You are four-wheel drive. Why are the front wheels... Ugh. Pop out. Come on. Pop out. Ugh. Can, we, can we get out? Thank you. <sighs> yay, yay. do this? Fine. Let's do it. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Yes, you did it. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. Wow, that is damn loud. But if we put the blade down, um, and you know what? I actually, <laughs> I haven't even tried to use this as a functional thing, but I mean, as long as we're on like this smooth area, I mean, this moves pretty well. I'm really happy with the way this came out. Uh, and if you guys like it, let me know. Hit that thumbs up button. If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe, subscribe, subscribe button. Tell your friends, friends, I can speak English today. Tell your family, you know, bring them along for the ride. Because we're always looking to entertain the people. Um, and if you guys have any creations, you know, if you guys play Scrap Mechanic, you know, let me know if you have any creations. Um, feel free to send them to me. I'd love to show them off to the rest of the, to the rest of the fam. You know, you guys should be proud of what you guys are making. Um, this is definitely a fun game, and I'm I'm excited to see what they do in the future, because obviously this is still early access. Um... All my contact stuff, you know, you can find it in my about section of YouTube. Um, Shapstar G 
gaming at gmail dot com. I think that's my uh <laughs> my email for this account. I think that's the one I made. I don't even know anymore. But it is in my about section. I think it's also in the description. But hit me up, you know, find me on the you on the Twitters, on the Facebooks. We are Facebook official. Woohoo! And you know, like again, you know, if you're new, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think, what you guys might like to see, and I will see you all in the next video.